disinfecting surfaces for the removal of the virus causing coronavirus disease 2019 requires the use of strong disinfecting agents. A few examples would be bleach, hydrogen peroxide, and you can use substances such as 70% alcohol or isopropyl alcohol, or a number of other substances that contain quaternary ammonium compounds, such as Lysol spray or disinfectant wipes. In order to correctly disinfect the surface, there needs to be a use of the disinfectant agent with an applicator. This applicator can be anything from cotton wool, gauze, or a clean, dry cloth. In order to disinfect the surface correctly, you must soak the applicator or your material with the disinfectant of choice and wipe your surface in one direction. After disinfecting the surface, you need to leave the disinfectant in contact with the surface for about one to five minutes, depending on the type of disinfectant that is used. As soon as the, the time has passed, and this time is referred to as your contact time, you can then proceed to use the surface. For other disinfectants, such as your disinfectant sprays and wipes, like Lysol and Clorox wipes, it's advisable that you use as directed, based on the instructions that are written on the back of the can or container that contain these substances and usually the contact time for these substances is between 1 and 10 minutes, with 10 minutes giving you the best results. There are a number of other substances that claim to have disinfecting properties, such as Fabuloso, Igenol, and substances of the like, but it should be known that these substances tend to remove germs rather than kill germs. If you will be using these substances, it is advisable that you first apply them, then use any of the substances previously mentioned in order to completely kill the organisms from the surface, thereby rendering the surface coronavirus free.